Hi, welcome to Blind Owl Outdoors. We hope you enjoy our channel. And if possible, could you please join our Patreon page? We really need your help. It's been a long, hard road. Thank you. Hi, welcome to Blind Owl Bushcraft and Survival. My name's Dan. I'm here in the Philippines. I'm sitting in my bamboo hut on the screened-in porch, which is fabulous. It's a 10 by 6 porch. Got a built-in table on it. This is where I used to do all my computer work. Um, the nice thing about this is the screened-in part because it's just... It, it's just... I can't even explain how bad the mosquitoes are outside. Uh, I just walked down to the road and I must have had 50 mosquitoes on my legs to swat them. I stopped to, in fact, I pick up a package that I just did a video of. I got some roll gold pretzels. Just stand there paying the guy. I must have got bit by 20 mosquitoes. Uh, and right where I'm at right now, there's woods and timber all around us, so it's, it's just nasty. So I thought I'd do a quick stone and steel fire. I'm going to make them small today because I'm in a in a bamboo hut, which is wood, old wood. I don't really want to burn the place down, so I won't have I won't have a great big bird's nest. I have some grass with me, some rice grass, so I'm going to make some small bird's nests. I have my little stone and steel basket here. Got a striker, which is a piece of a file epoxied into a, a deer antler. And let's take out a real nice gray quartzite stone or whatever kind of stone it is. Oops, sorry for bumping the camera there. I have napkin, napkin char cloth, char. Which is getting more and more questionable with the humidity. You got to watch out. Just stuff like that just soaks up the humidity. Let's make a little tender bundle here. We don't need a very big one. Make it right into a little nest shape. There we go. Now a lot of times you'll find that, at least I do, especially in the high humidity, that a um, sparks will hit your char, but they won't start. And that's because it's getting a little humid or something damp. And then what I do is I'm chipping, I just blow on the, the char cloth and I usually take Now I'm in a screened in area, so I'm not too worried about the smoke or anything like that. I just don't want to start a fire in the house here. That's my main thing on the in the hut. There's a simple little fire there. See how smoky it is though? That's because everything's damp. Okay. That little bucket here. Put a box over the top and see if that'll smother it out. Yeah, it worked pretty good, except it's a lot of smoke now. Okay, that's not perfect there. <laughs> Sorry for all the smoke. Well, take care, everybody. 
Hashtag 22 a day no more. Go out, have some fun. There we go. Let's just start it back up again. Um, what do I got here? Got a piece of plywood here. There we go. That'll put it out. <laughs> a little smoky. Hashtag 22 a day no more. Go out, have some fun. Watch your six really close. Um, watch out for crowds and mobs and stuff like that. Uh, there's going to be a lot of more stuff going on. Like, you know, a couple days ago, President Trump got shot in the ear at a rally. So, I bet we'll be seeing more stuff. Maybe not assassination attempts, but we're going to be seeing more. Uh, Probably more school shootings and who knows whatever else could be going on. I'm curious today. He's uh, today's the beginning of the Republican convention, and uh, he said he was going to come on Thursday and accept the nomination. But I'm wondering if he'll come early and and uh, uh, say who is running, who his running mate's going to be, and stuff like that. Kind of curious to hear about that. I'm sure it's the guy from Florida. But, uh, take care, everybody. We'll see you later. Thanks for watching. Take care.